Did you know that 1 billion hours of videos are watched every day on YouTube and 400 hours of videos are uploaded every minute? 70% of YouTube watch time is generated from mobile devices. So how on earth can you make your thumbnail stand out from your competitors? In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly and easily create an attractive thumbnail for your videos using Thumbnail Blaster, a thumbnail maker for YouTube. Stay tuned to the end of the video to download my free thumbnail checklist so you can create an attractive thumbnail that wins a click. Let's jump over the computer so I can give you a demo of Thumbnail Blaster from within the membership area. On the left, I've got YouTube accounts that I can link to Thumbnail Blaster. I've got the thumbnail creator to create my thumbnails. AI image analyzer, which analyzes images so they can be suitable for my thumbnails. Split test, which means you can split test two different thumbnails. Training videos, which gives you step-by-step -step training along the way. Click add YouTube account. I'm gonna select an account. Choose your account. Thumbnail Blaster wants to access your Google account. Click allow. Here's one of my channels. Click thumbnail creator. I can select a video from this channel from the YouTube link. Or start with no video. So let's do start with no video. Now I can choose from all these templates. Let's select this video marketing template. Click use template. Now I can move around the text by just dragging and dropping. I can add shapes. I can upload an image. I can change the background. I can use solid. I can use gradients. I can use patterns. I can change the opacity. I can add a shadow. I can add a stroke. I can add layers. I can duplicate it if I want. I can bring the image forward. Bring the image to the front, send it backward, send it to the back, flip horizontally, flip vertically, duplicate it, trash it, or lock it. I change this to Thumbnail Maker, click Change Image. For the purpose of this video, I'm just going to select an image of myself. Okay, I might change this image later to find a better image. I can save it as a JPEG, or I'll click Save and Continue. I can save it as a PNG file, JPEG file, save it with a watermark, or publish on YouTube. So I'm just going to click publish. I can select the YouTube channel or select the YouTube video. I'm not going to publish on YouTube at this stage. For the purpose of this video, I'm going to select save as PNG. I'm going to call it new thumb and now it's saved. If you want to get your own copy of Thumbnail Blaster, click the link in the description below this video. AI Image Analyzer. The artificial intelligence image analyzer will analyze any image to see if it's suitable for your thumbnail. I click on AI Image Analyzer, I can select an image link or YouTube video or upload local image. Click upload local image. I'm going to select this Hunter image. Click open and then I'm going to click analyze image. The software has analyzed the image under adult, medical, spoof, violence and racy. So it's not adult, unlikely to be marked as medical content, unlikely to be marked as spoof content, very unlikely to be marked as violent content and unlikely to be marked as racy content. So you can check any of your images through this artificial intelligence. Recommendation is your image is optimized for Google and YouTube search. You do not need to make any modifications to the image. So if you have any doubts about using an image for your thumbnail, run it through the AI image analyzer. It's a fantastic tool that comes with the software. Split testing. This is where you can split test two different thumbnails for your video to see which one gets the most traffic. Instead of guessing which thumbnail will get the most traffic, Running a split test will give you more definite data. If I click split test, click new split test, I can select a YouTube account, YouTube video, or I can select my thumbnails. For the purpose of this video, I'm just going to select a couple of different thumbnails that I've already created. I'll select my thumbnails folder. I can compare this thumbnail with this thumbnail as an example. It says split test will run for two hours. We will change the thumbnail once per hour and record the number of views each thumbnail gets. At the end, we'll pick the winning thumbnail, the thumbnail that gets the most views. So I can select 12 hours, split test run for one day and two hours, or I can go right to the end, split test will run for 10 days. Let's click add split test. If you ever get stuck creating a thumbnail while using the software, these training videos will take you through it step by step. If I click training videos, got full training video, select a YouTube video, Loading templates, using the editor, saving and publishing, split testing, AI image analysis. So this is a great tool if you want to quickly and easily create an attractive thumbnail for your videos, even if you don't have any design skills. If you want to get your own copy of Thumbnail Blaster, click the link in the description below this video. You don't have to download any software. It only takes a few clicks. You can triple the views of any old videos that need a new thumbnail. You can split test two different thumbnails. You've got hundreds of templates you can modify. 
You can use AI technology to analyze the images for your thumbnails, and the software integrates with the YouTube channel so you'll save a ton of time. If you want to download my 10-point checklist for creating an attractive thumbnail, click the image below. You'll discover how to create a clickable thumbnail that stands out from your competitors. If you like this video, be sure to give it a like, post a comment, and subscribe to the channel for more content like this. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you.